G'day guys, Batch here and welcome back to the channel and the Hunter Call of the Wild. Yes, I am back. <laughs> had a little break, then I had an extended break because I caught a cold. Still got it. And today, I am just on the edge of Petersham here and I have a few towels I need to open up. And look at that, I've got $400,000. So not a problem there. We'll get this done. Let's get on the way. It's a beautiful morning. Look at that, sun's coming up. Got a leak in front of us, let's have a look around and see what we can find. Oh, just walked across the lake and we have found us a big male pig. Looks like that type of area, doesn't it? All this undergrowth, they love it in here. I'm sure there's a pig zone or two I need to open up around here. So I'll give it a call. We'll get this thing marching towards us. I will use the 270 with the polymer tip bullet on this. Might as well. You can usually get them in the lungs pretty good with that, or in the spine. If you dare, the old heart shot. Gotta say, it is good to be back. It's good to have a rest from the game. Also, I like to keep fresh, as I've told you before. Don't want my videos going stale, or me going stale on the game. I did play a bit of Guild Wars 2, the new expansion. Bit of fun there. You got mounts and everything now. Alright, there's one of the towers over there I have to open up. And I appear to have a road deer coming up behind me. Haven't been calling them. Not really interested, unless it's a buck. And this one's really close, hasn't even noticed me. Must be half asleep or something. It is early in the morning, maybe it just woke up. Let's see how long it takes before it notices me. Oh, it's got to see me now. What are you doing, you silly deer? Oh, there it goes. Could have thrown a rock at that thing. Knocked it out. Okay, this pig is slowly making its way towards me, I hope. There might be more than one. There usually is. Could be about four of them, if we're lucky. I'll give it another call. Get this thing moving. And I probably should take a break more often. My channel has been going bananas for me. For such a small channel. And there's that little pig. I need to get this thing in the clear. Give it a shot. Hopefully it goes down pretty quick. It looks like not a bad size one. So I could get a few bucks out of this. There it is. Oh, here we go. We're gonna get a shot in now. Just let him move past these trees and we'll be right. Patience is the name of this game. Take your time, get the right shot. Here we go. Well, there was a second pig. Our first one is down. The other one looks like I hit it in the gut. So we'll check this thing out. See how much we get. Looks like not a bad one. Bit of a bruiser. Well, it is a nice gold one. Just over a thousand dollars. And the polymer tip went straight through. Hit both lungs. Let's go find its mate. Yep, thought I hit it. We do have blurred, so we'll be able to track this down pretty easy. And after a bit of tracking, I have caught up to it, and it is down. It's probably a female. I didn't really get a good look at it, just shot at it. So it'd be interesting to see. I'm going to have trouble squashing these things down, so we'll just pick the pig up. <laughs> oh, it is a male. I didn't realise that. There we go. And I no quick kill bonus on that one. Alright, finally got to our first tower. We'll open this up. It could be one of those little hunting boxes. Looks nice under here, like the canopy in Hirschfelden. 
You get the sun coming through. It looks fantastic. I have been hunting here a fair bit. I did go to Leighton Lakes the other day and have a hunt while I was pretty sick with a head cold. I couldn't even shoot straight. I was going to make a video. <laughs> but I don't think I could have even edited it at that point. So I didn't even bother. Uh, what is this thing? Hopefully it's a hunting box. I sort of like them out in Hirschfelden. You can get on the roof. Yeah, it is a hunting box. So we can get on the roof. Just use this like a rock. I won't be calling many animals in. This is a bit of a travelling and walking hunt. Okay, that was a pretty uneventful walk to the next tower. We are nearly here. I did walk through a nice pig zone. Open that up. There didn't appear to be any in there though. It's probably the wrong time of day. You do get a lot of wild balls around here. Haven't seen any fallow deers yet. And I know there are red deers here. So I'll be calling them. I'm looking for them. I've got a roe deer up here. I'm going to take the shot. Back of the head. Should do the trick. Now I'm not sure if you saw the antlers then. But that was a male. It was tiny. Pretty much looked like a female at distance. Let's go check these little antlers out. A little blurred. Look at that. Looks like a female from there, but there are the antlers. He's only just got on the poor little thing. Huh, little bronze one. Got yourself a bullet in the brain. Okay, got our next tower. Let's put this up. I'm making a few bucks back today, so that's alright. I get no XP at all, as you notice, with any of my harvest now. Or <laughs> opening up towers. I had a red deer call. I cannot see it. It is in the distance somewhere. So I'll drop a few calls to try and get it interested. Pretty good to males. You just got to be really careful. They can spook easy, but they will come back if you're persistent. That's what I found out anyway. So I'm just going to crouch my way ahead. Try and entice this red deer in. I like shooting them actually. I need a bigger one. I've only got gold on them, I'm pretty sure. I want a diamond of every animal. Hard to find. There he is. Look at that. And no, he's not a diamond. He has just run off. Did he run off? Because he can't smell me and I'm really far away. I'm not sure what's going on here. Look how far away I am. I have to call him back now. This is a pain. As you saw then, it sort of did spook. Well, this got stuck on something, but it looked like it ran off to me. And the reason all these towers are open is I haven't been to Perdition pretty much since when I first got the game. First went to Hirchfelden, I ran through it, opened up a few things. Pretty much haven't been back here. And where is this red deer? I'm going to keep going until it pops its head up. I want it to come back. I thought I might have run up that hill. I can't see it anywhere. Damn it. Okay, after a few more calls and a bit of patience, it has come back. Looks okay. It's no world beater. I like getting red deers. Down on the flats here, you do get a few of them. And they're good to see. It's not all pigs and fallow deer. Although I haven't seen a fallow deer yet. It's not all wild boar and roe deer. Let's get this red deer. Let's need it to come out. It's way behind that little ledge there, and I can't see that. I can just see it's the top of its head or its antlers. I don't really want to go for a headshot. Yeah, that's it. Walk out in the clear. Might go for a hard shot here if I can get it in. It's a dangerous shot. If you miss it, you're in trouble. Oh, so I missed the hard shot there. The second shot done all the damage. Probably went straight through its head. And it did give a bellow as it was going down. That is unbelievable. Let's go pick it up. At least it didn't run off. 
because that's the problem with the heart shot. If you miss it, you just hit muscle sometimes. You might hit lung. Polymer tip might have hit lung. Let's have a look. Well, I can't really complain. It's over $1,000. It's silver. And I did hit the lung and the brain. The brain was the killer shot, really. Uh, while we're walking through here, we'll have a quick look at the map so you can see where I am and how far I've got to walk. Still got to walk all the way down Petersham to these two towers down here. Still got a bit of a walk in front of me, that's for sure. I found a fantastic rock to perch on and I have a wild boar coming towards me here. Let's have a look at it. It is a male. So I'm going to let him wander up a little bit closer. That's pretty cool up here. Have a look. Look at this view. Let's see all around. Like these cornfields. Real good hunting. You do get a good view of all the animals except foxes sometimes. They're that small. They're very hard to see. Well, he isn't in any hurry at all. He's just taking his time. And he appears to be alone. Can't see any others around him. They would stand out like the proverbials, wouldn't they? So I'm just going to have to wait on him. This is a huge rock I'm standing on or leaning on. Oh, got a red deer. Might have to cancel the pig. Go to that male over there. That's a pretty cool one. It looks all right. And it is trotting. We might have to give this a call. And we'll shoot the deer. We might get both. If we're lucky, you could get both here if you work it out right. I'm not very sharp though. I still have this head cold. So it may not work out. <laughs> Let me think on it. But I think I'll chance it. I'm just going to have to get this red deer coming towards me. So let's drop a call or two. It was trotting this way, so if I'm lucky, yeah, there it is. All right, this is good. All right, so all you new players, this scope I'm using is called the Hyper Iron. Probably the best thing you can buy in the game. It'll fit on all the rifles, except lever actions. Let's shoot this deer and maybe the pig. of that. That is bad shooting all around. I think I missed that pig by a mile. Yeah, couldn't find any blood of the boar. The red deer is bleeding. We can track it. Okay, after a lot of tracking, I've caught up to it. Still looks pretty healthy. It's in here somewhere. Let me just scope it up and we'll get this thing. Oh yeah, that felt good. Back of the headshot, <laughs> straight down. I've tracked this forever, so there will be no <laughs> quick kill bonus on this, that's for sure. And there's a little blurred on the ground, so that was a good shot. Finally. Oh, surprise, surprise, I did hit it three times. Two, twice on the run. Then that back of the headshot. Over a thousand dollars, so I can't complain, but I put a lot of tracking in him. I come across an old shack on the way to my tower. It's open. Let's uh, check it. I probably have been here. You will find collectibles in these things, so they're worth checking out. If you come across it, just have a quick look. The collectible will be shining really bright, and all you got to do is pick it up. Get some XP. Well, check this out. I haven't been here since I first came to the game. I forgot we had this wind farm here. There you go. It's how long since I've been here. <laughs> a little look around. 
I did get my first fellow deer. I remember that down here in the gate. It's pretty much on the side of that road over there. And we do have a fox in front of us. So I've walked pretty much right across the map to get here. I should come back here a bit more. I really forgot about this place. <laughs> I think it's in my very first video of the Hunter Call of the Wild. And you'll see the fellow deer in that that I got. There we go. It's one of those boxes, they're my favourites. So let's walk to the other tower and we'll open that up. Oh, I'm doing a lot of walking today, but I'll get these things done. I think after I open all these up, I only have eight left in Hirschfelden. Then I'll have to go attack the new reserve when that opens and open everything up by far net. Because I've got so much cash, it doesn't matter. And let's open this up. What is it? Oh. They're not my favourite, because you only fit one person in them. And here we are on the map. Look how far we walked. I've only got that one left right across. So we will walk to that and open it up. So it won't be long and I'll have all this map completed. Except for zones, of course. As you can see, I don't have many towers left. They're pretty much open all up there. I had two way up the top I have to get to. Once I get to the outpost, not a problem. Now, I have been levelling up my pistol. I'm up to the panther now. I still haven't unlocked the scope for it, though. But I will get there. Drop a few calls for red deer while we're on our way and everything else that could come out of the woods. We haven't seen a fellow deer yet, wouldn't mind getting one of those. I'm just going to walk all the way to the next tower. Might as well finish the video like that. Have a look through the paddock. You never know what you see standing there. Got those little pine trees around here, so it probably wouldn't be good for the ATV. It will get stuck on those things. Look at that rock up there. Pretty cool formation. Uh, another female roe deer, I won't worry about that. I haven't called any of them today. They just seem to wander in all. Oh, no matter where you are in Hirschfeld, you will come across roe deer. Females get a bit annoying, but they are good if you're just leveling up and you want some cash. Roe deer are pretty good, especially with bow and arrow. You just knock one off, one half of the other. Just having a look ahead of me. As I walk, just in case there is something hiding in the trees there. Like right, a fellow deer, because this is my last chance to get one. And that reminds me, if any has watched the video of me and Ali in the Call of the Wild, she has started her own channel. It's in my featured channels on my channel page. She's only got one video up at the moment, but I'm sure there will be more to come. She'll be doing the Hunter Call of the Wild and Guild Wars 2. Whatever other game she's playing at the time. And it's not too long now before we can get our hands on the new reserve. It looks really good. I did watch some of the live stream. It was pretty late for me when they Expansive Worlds had it on. I did have a watch and it looked really nice. The guy was trying to shoot a must there. Don't know how he did in the end. But I can't wait till that comes out. I think it's only going to be, I think they said 7.99 euros, so that's probably like 14 or 15 dollars for me here in Australia. Wherever else you live, you just got to work out the exchange rate. But it's not too expensive, so it should be pretty good. And we've got somewhere else to go and hunt. That'll be fantastic, and I'm looking forward to getting those links. They look pretty cool. You won't be able to call them, that's for sure. But that'll be a challenge. Good challenge. And here we are on a map. We are nearly at the end of our travels. Have a look at that through the binoculars. Looks pretty interesting up there. Probably around the other side you can get up on that. Get a good view, I'd imagine. Yeah, so before the new reserve comes upon us, I want to open up all the Hirschfeld. And I think I have, after this, eight more towers to open up. I should get that done. And get started on the new map. And like I said before, apparently there's no new guns or no new callers. I don't know about the levels. I hope there is new levels for us. Especially for the people who are at level 60 now. And not getting any XP. If they had more levels, we'd be able to put more points between for our perks and skills, hopefully. 
Yeah, so I didn't mention that. I did ask the question, they didn't answer it. And like I said, I couldn't stay on the stream too long. It was way too late for me. So it's good to be back making videos and starting to feel a bit more normal now. So now that I have this video almost under my belt, channel will go back to normal and I'll go and happy about that. I was getting a bit self-conscious about it. Thinking, oh my God, I haven't made a video in about two weeks. So yeah, it was getting a bit scary there, but I'm back guys. And it was a pretty lean hunt for the first one back. What did we get? A couple of wild boars. No, maybe three. Three wild boars and two male red deers. And a small male roe deer to the back of the head. Got him a beauty. But yeah, it's cost me more than I've made, that is for sure. I'm not too worried about that. Let's get this last one up in there. It's pettish and complete. And as you see once again, no XP. So it's only about a week to go guys before the new reserve is out and I'm looking forward to making some new videos on that map. And I want to do one section of the map at a time. I don't want it to get confusing. But I do want to find some lynx and some reindeer. If you haven't seen reindeer in the Hunter Classic, they're like a majestic type of animal, the males. I really love them. So they'll be fun to hunt. I'm not sure if we're going to have a caller for them. And I'm pretty sure we won't have a caller for the lynx because they said no new callers so maybe the reindeer might answer to the fellow deer i'm not sure well guys it's great to be back i hope you enjoyed that thanks for dropping by and i'll catch you on the next one